Uh, a crooked one. Giovanni. He's a spirit. Uh, inspired by me and Michelle. Michelle is uh, one of who I like to call the old stalkers. Um, and uh, Oh, not just Michelle, but Muji. Basically, Michelle was using my focal point to talk to Muji. And she kept... Um, Trying to speak to Muji, and then he eventually got sort of sucked into all this kind of, um, and started replying to Michelle. And between me, Muji, and Michelle, uh, Giovanni came forth. And just as I was trying to think of his name, Muji said, "You are the limitless one." And I thought he is a crooked one. Um, he. Uh, uh, that. He fucks shit up, um, sometimes not for the good of all. Uh, he's a real free spirit, but he is a lover of all. Uh, ground shaker, rule breaker, what does that mean? Um, it means he'll do anything. Um, and whenever he does do something, he makes shockwaves. Uh, he leaves a... Uh, Trail of destruction. Wherever he goes. There's a side to Muji that not many people talk about. But the people that know Asher. That's myself. Um, they see this side in him. They know it well. Because he appreciates. And this is, this is about Giovanni. My son. Because he appreciates the beauty of harmonious lower frequency so much. That he can take and does take. And carry, uh, he can take and does carry anything. And he makes use of it. Uh, I made Conor McGregor his godfather. Because he resonates. It just in, in, I saw that he would be a good godfather to him. Uh, whether McGregor wants to give him guidance or not, of course, that's his choice. But uh, I, I think he will. He just will because they resonate. Uh, he is a divine masculine spirit. Um, he is a crooked one. Uh, he is a powerful one. That's what he is. He's powerful. 